Like we were hearing phantom like buzzing sounds in our room, our hotel room. Like, like whose phone is that? Is that ours? And Do we're we like, have it? I'm Bye. so excited that I get to be the last person from the real world to see you guys before you take off on your journey. Oh. It is so crazy oh what we're gosh. going through. It's yeah. an emotional roller coaster. And take we haven't us even through started it. yet. Yeah, it's crazy. First off, you have to say goodbye to all of your family and friends forever. Secondly, yeah. which is so weird, you have to say goodbye to all social media telephones, emails, emails. Like we were hearing phantom like buzzing sounds in our room, our hotel room. Like, like whose phone is that? Is that ours? And Do we're we like, have it? we no, don't have a phone. Yeah. So it's really weird, but you get, you kind of get used to it. But you can really expect to take on anything <laughs> on The Amazing Race. Oh, we're ready mentally. We all, we've it, also right? watched Pretty Woman and The Notebook. I feel like, yeah, a lot of I feel like our, our hearts are full mm -hmm. and um, our bodies are ready. <laughs> what is your biggest fear? So I was always deathly frightened of bungee jumping. Mm -hmm. So we just did it two weeks ago. We so bungee jumped. I'm really, really afraid of fish. When I was a kid, I had a traumatic experience. I caught a fish inside of the flap of my bikini bottom of my bathing suit. It wasn't a bikini, it was a one piece, let's yeah. be real. But it was flapping around in there. Ooh. It's traumatizing. Mm -hmm. And so I don't like yeah. fish. I don't like touching them, really getting near them or even eating them. There's going to be a lot of stuff that's going to push us to the limits, I know, mm -hmm. on the show. But I'm, I feel ready for it. Are there any locations you guys think together as a team you will dominate location wise. Yeah. Well, if we do anything with elephants, I'm gonna wet my pants just a little bit. <laughs> so I've got a little diaper just in case something okay. gets crazy. I love elephants. I'm obsessed with them. If I have to do anything with an elephant, although I feel like it might slow us down because I'll just be like kissing Entrance. it and hugging it and trying to get to know it better. And Jocelyn's well, like, we have to go. So what do you guys think you are at an advantage for against the mm -hmm. other teams? Well, Erin already said this, and I think our advantage is that we're kind of a sleeper. Like, I don't know what kind of judgments people will make based on what they know that we do for a living or They've already whatever. asked us about our makeup. So I know they think that we're just That's girly like girls. like what we're concerned with. So, which is kind of great. You always want to be the underdog and the one that people aren't really looking to. Like, yeah. we're not the buffest, tallest. Exactly. We are buff. You're pretty you buff. You can talk and your body is ripped. You want to see my back muscles? It's yes. so ripped. Look at Look that at my back. back muscle. Oh. Oh. So Did you make snacks. some room in your bags yeah. for snacks? We have snacks. Mm -hmm. We Person also guys. have a safe word in case Jocelyn gets hangry or I get like mean. Um, our safe word is Taylor Swift. Yeah. <laughs> so for like, give me a break, I need a minute, it's Taylor, Taylor Swift. Swift. So imagine you guys okay. are approaching the finish line pad area. Yes. Because <laughs> it's yes. not a finish line, it's a pad. Yeah. Pit stop. What soundtrack is playing? A whole new world. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Mine's the Rocky theme song. Yes, yeah. I have a tiger. Da 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 kind of think we might need on the race that maybe some other competitors might not have brought. So I have duct tape, a bungee cord, a compass. a compass, you have rope, lots of rope and carabiners. Uh huh. Cool. Um, we probably are going to have to wash all of our own clothes. So we have a little tie detergent. Mm -hmm. Um, we have the smallest curling iron in the world. Oh my gosh. Wait, what? what? It's a mini curler. We haven't named him yet. I think we should Those call him exist. Leroy or Isn't something. Isn't it so cute? Oh my gosh. Do you yes. want to hold He's him like for a little, second? Adorable. Isn't it adorable? It just takes you four hours to do it, but it's totally can, worth can it. Can everything be this mini? Isn't it so cute? It's like so the cute. little channel with the little hamsters eating little meals. Ooh, actually, I have one last question. Yeah. Who's your biggest competition? We're gonna be friends with everyone. All these people are already at the top of the game in the digital world, so you can't look at someone like that and say they're not super talented or super smart or, or super driven or yeah. ambitious. So that's why we can't count anyone out right now. What? Wow. What is happening? Dana's taking her clothes Woo! off. Anything for reality. Yeah! Yeah! Work it, work it, uh huh. Work it. Oh my gosh, you're part of the Rhonda Burgundy team. <laughs> You can be a Rhonda Burgundy. Dana. You know, it just so happened that I put this on this morning. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm on Team Maroon. <laughs> oh my gosh. But really, I'm oh, so excited for you, you guys. Oh and I, I feel very lucky that I get to be the last person You're to last send you person. off no. on your journey. Wait, I have a question. What? Could you fit in a backpack? You come with us. Anything. Come with it. Hold on to your pants. We've got all the handiest and dandiest poop accessories around in that box on the left and on the right. Click it to watch Jocelyn and I eat weird food covered in chocolate.